Here we go, students. We're climbing up to set up camp. It's about 4.15 p.m. Uh, we'll set up camp, take some video of that, head home for some dinner, then come back for the night. I'm here live with Mr. Park of Team 3 up on the roof helping us scope things out. Uh, Mr. Park, what's the point of all this anyway? It's because we donated um, over 200 objects for the Foster family, um, which is super exciting. Um, and how we could be a tight community donating things uh, um, with good heart. Yeah. So are celebrating. you wishing you'd be sleeping on the roof tonight? I wish, um, but... I'd rather sleep in our one bed. Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, this is Mr. Van Harn, uh, Grand Rapids Christian's very own adventure expert. What are you unpacking there, Mr. Van Harn? We've got a, a, a nearly retired tent from the Adventure Club stash that we're going to be using tonight. This might be its last trip, actually. What do you think about our campsite selection up here, Mr. Schultz? I think we made the right choice. Based on the wind coming from the east and this wall here blocking it, I think we're going to be toasty warm and have a good night's sleep right here. Well, kids, I headed home for dinner. Now I'm back on the old bicycle. Don't bike and film, you know. And heading back to school, where I hope to see many of you soon. Here we go. Back up the ladder. Well, it's about 6.45. And now I'm just waiting for our first, first visitor. I wonder who it'll be. I gotta say a shout out to uh, the Theobald family who left waiting for me a little care package already. And how fitting is that? Since it was Mrs. Theobald who first introduced the idea of fostering the family to us. Here we go, some nice, some nice zero sugar meat sticks. Thanks, Theobalds. We got our first visitors. There they are. Yeah, with the honk. Into the camera. All right, look at this turnout. Yeah. You guys will be in the documentary. Yes. There's uh, just hot water and I put a hot chocolate of powder in it. Oh, Mr. Kim, you shouldn't have. Say hi, Viscars. All right. All right, there's Jason Eddie. Say hi. Woo! Hey guys, good work. Yes. There's Sig. Give a wave, Sig. All right. We're gonna head in the tent for the night, but this is all the food we didn't eat, believe it or not. Thanks everybody, your generosity continues to amaze us. Just when we thought the visitors were through, who should show up but my in-laws, Randy and Lori Elders. With a nice steamy pizza. Yeah. It's like a space heater for your tent. <laughs> It's 10 p.m. We're in the tent, cozied up for the night. We'll see you all in the morning. Morning, everyone. It's about 6 a.m. and it was a great sleep. Uh, about to have some coffee and breakfast, much of which the breakfast items at least are thanks to Evergreen students. All right, as we wrap things up, mm -hmm. You gotta get off to the high school. People are gonna be asking how it was, you know, all those high school teachers and students. What are you gonna tell them for your highlight? Mm, I'd say my highlight was definitely the Lord's Chicken. Mm. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Holly. Yeah. Holly, Hendricks, and Harrison, Chick fil A. Mm. Delicious. Oh, delicious. Morning, Baron! Morning, Lydia. Happy jammy day. There's Cooper. Good morning, buddy. All right. You had to because we got the two That's right. That's right. Good morning, Henry. Wave to the camera. Tessa, wave to the camera. Adrian, what do you have to say? Why are you up there? <laughs> Tell, ask Tessa. Ask Tessa. Hi, Eden and Thea, welcome back. 
How was your night? Good, there you go. Okay. Not as bad, not on the roof. Not as bad because you weren't on the roof? 